out with the TV. Now I can find Dylan. And Dylan isn't here. He might be nearby. Or maybe the hiss got to him. I don't know. Jesse, listen. Dylan's here. With us. He just walked in. He says he is giving himself up. He's been affected by the hiss, but, but he is different than the others. We must isolate him. I'm on my way. See my brother.
HRAs is purely antithetical to every... No, it's happening. After all these years, Dylan is here. Oh, but am I too late? How is he? I need to know. He's clearly been affected by the Hiss, but it's different than any other manifestation we've recorded. Maybe what makes you so special is genetic. He was a prime candidate. Or maybe it's Polaris protecting him, something else affecting the situation. I need to run tests. He seems more in control, more present. I want to see him. My brother? Or is he? Of course. Now, Marshall set up an HRA-warded cage to contain him. It's on the upper floor, up the stairs. Okay, I need to go. Jesse, be careful. The residence of many HRAs is purely... Oh, my God. She have to write everything in a made-up <laughs> gibberish code. Fucking Marshall, for CIA spy shit. God. I don't think I ever told you this, but I was actually on the path to being a ranger once. Did the whole boot camp thing. Even got rookie status. Anyway, not the point. My own ranger squad was a great bunch. There was six plus me. Remus, Hazard, Cho, Guy, Hepton, Stall, and Thompson. They were supposed to get back from an expedition yesterday. We had beers and wings planned. Problem is, they weren't here when Darling handed out the HRAs. Then they had nothing protecting them from the Hiss. You see, they prepped for the worst, but I think that we're already past that. We all wore these pouches around our neck, and I really don't want the Hiss to get them. Could you find them for me? Uh, the squad would have come back through maintenance, but they probably spread out from there. I'll keep an eye out for them, Arish. And I won't let them stay his. I have to go. Me too. You're not the only one who's busy, you know. Things were stabilizing. Marshall abandons us. I'm sick of no one telling us what's going on. Information's always been on a need to know basis. Well, I need to fucking know. Marshall orders us to just sit on our asses and then leaves? What's the deal? Apparently, the director restored HRA production. They're already getting other survivors. You are a worm through time. The thunder's home distorts you. Happiness comes, white pearls, but yellow and red in the eye. Through a mirror and inverted his made right. Leave your insides by the door. Push the fingers through the surface into the way. You've always been in here. You are this betrayal. We stand around you while you dream. You can almost hear our words, but you forget. Through time, the thunder's home distorts you. Happiness comes. You are a worm through time. Shit. The thunder's home distorts you. That's Happy Dylan. Why, Pearl, Can you hear me? Oh, oh come on, on, Dylan. I'm here. I found you. You Do you know who I am? Oh, you know me. Say it. You are Dylan Faden's sister. He's talking in the third person. 
Always a good sign. Do you know who you are? Not Dylan. Trench and Darling made sure of that. I'm P6. P6. But I'm better now. The hiss made me better. Push the fingers through the surface into the wet. You've always been the new you. You want this Please stop that. Please. <sighs> Not exactly the reunion I'd hoped for. It feels good to say those words. I want to say them. They sound good. They make me feel good. Don't you want to say them too? No. Fuck off, no. You need to help me get this thing out of his head. If he is still in there, if there is anything left, you have to you. help me. You! You came in through the hole in you. We let you in. You've always been here. The only child of a copy of a copy of a copy of a copy Stop it! Orange field. Shit! Shit! He can see you. This is not safe. We found Polaris together with my sister when we were very small. In ordinary. In the desert, through the door opened up by the slide projector. But she didn't help when Trench took me away. She didn't give me any powers. All the powers are my own powers. <laughs> she didn't help when they locked me up for years. After the song time for applause, we build you till nothing remains. The air cracks and the truth will emerge out of you. You are home. The Bureau brought the slide projector back here with me. And the Bureau did what the Bureau does. They used it. And they found... They opened the door up to the hiss. That's the only thing I can thank them for. There. There it is. We stopped the Altered World event in Ordinary when we shut down the slide projector. And now the projector's here. I'm your worm is a tune you can't stop humming in a dream. Baby, 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 yeah. Just plastic, so safe, nothing to worry about. <laughs> Funny. I welcomed the hiss. I let it in to get rid of her. The hiss set me free. Polaris is using you. The Bureau is using you. You are a puppet. You can almost hear our words, but you forget. If we shut this off the slide projector, maybe, maybe that will stop the hiss. Your regulations. Maybe it's not too late for my brother. You must see the truth for yourself, Jesse. Sister. The horrible truth about the Bureau. The hiss is the better option. Go to the prime candidate program in the containment sector. I have the key card to get you there. Salvador wanted me to have it. Wanted? Bullshit. I saw what the hiss did to Salvador. What it turned him into. Okay, Dylan. I'll go. I want to see the truth for myself. I'll go. But only to look for this light projector. You can help me. We can end this. You are a worm through time. You are a worm through time. The thunder's home distorts you. Happiness comes with white pearls, but yellow and red in the eye. Through a mirror, the inverted is... I don't know what else I'm hoping to find here. Dylan. Can we talk? I'd like to tell you about a dream I had last night. Off to a good start. Okay. I'm listening. I was back in Ordinary. Before all of this happened. But in the dream, I was alone. It was just me. 
I was the only child. A girl. My name was Jesse Dylan Faden. But then the Bureau came and caught me, brought me back here, locked me up. Have you ever noticed that our names, Jesse, Dylan, they could be girls' names, boys' names, could be anything. Don't you find that weird? I find that weird. Sure. What the hell was that? Is he trying to mess with me? You are a one through time.